We recently featured one of the Colorverse Kingdom Project series inks, and it was the number 20 purple Tang Pai Yang, um, and we had a request to get swatches of all of these out there. So we're going to go ahead and make swatches of the complete collection for you today. First, we have number 17, Gei Guk, and I'm not going to say any of these right pronunciation-wise, just so you know. Right up front, I'll go ahead and claim that. Each of the different inks in this collection attempt to capture the dignity of the six kings of the Chosun Kingdom, and that dynasty continued for over 500 years. So that second one was number 18, Nala Smalsami, and next we're going to do number 19, Taep Yeong Seong Dae. And that one actually goes down immediately. You see some interesting, looks like it's gonna shade really well. Okay, next we have, uh, I believe this is the one that we, yeah, number 20, Tang Pai Yeong. This is the ink that we just featured recently um, in a comparison of different purple inks. And if you missed that, um, scroll back a bit in our feed and check it out. This next one's number 21, Kai Jang Gak. And it is, a kind of, this kind of stands out in this series because of its color, the red there. And then we have number 22, Daehan Jaeguk. And just so you have all the information, we did put these down just with a paintbrush and a J. Herbin spiral dip glass pen on Clairefontaine Triumph paper. It's one of our classic choices um, of products to use when we're sampling inks. I'll go ahead and put the title of the series up at the top here, and then we'll get you a look at these inks dry. So this is a look at them dry, see what you think. This series is full of great shading possibilities. For more information, visit pinchalay.com.